Get out of the situation. Hi, I'm T. Kent Nelson with Cutting Edge Defensive Tactics, and this is the second installment of our tactical training tips. Uh, in the first one, we looked at hand fighting. We talked about just pathways of motion and getting control and grabbing the wrists. Now we're going to show why we want to have that control. Joining me again is Officer Mike Schlumbeck from the Northwood Police Department out of Ohio. Uh, he's going to help me once again with this. I'm going to play the attacker. And Officer Swanback is simply going to use the hand fighting uh, methods that we used before to stop me from striking him. And this is why you want to get control of the hands. Um, and this is why you don't just, just, we're looking at releases and movement, but we're looking at control. So I'm just going to strike at him, and he's going to defend himself. Stop fighting, sir! Stop fighting! Stop fighting, sir! Stop fighting! Sir, stop fighting! Sir, stop fighting! As you, as you can see, by simply gaining control of the hands and doing the hand fighting drills, I couldn't strike them at all. This is designed to teach officers to protect themselves and not take that extra strike.